Hello and welcome to your new video on this channel. I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So today I want to show you guys a new update that was made for the demo my WordPress plugin. So until now it could uh, create new demo sites on a, a network install of WordPress, on a multi-site install of WordPress for users and it could activate themes and plugins for them. However, starting from now, it will be able to also clone the main website of the multi-site install of your WordPress and to present a cloned website to uh, customers who create demos with this plugin. So let me show you how the plugin worked before the update and how it can work now. It uh, still kept its original behavior, but it has some additional features now. So let me go to plugin settings here in my uh, multi-site install here and if you check there were added two new checkboxes clone main site for generated demo site and clone also files of the main site so if we uncheck these two checkboxes that were added in the latest update we will get exactly the same behavior as before so let me show you how the plugin was working before so let us check here and uh, let us fill in the capture and click create demo so the plugin will create a demo for the customer here and if we check the site you will see that it is a plain website it is a new install of wordpress he just got activated some plugins and a theme that we set with the shortcode so this is the shortcode which uh, was generated by the for the plugin it activates these plugins and it switches this theme on okay but now let me show you what feature was added to the plugin so first of all let's log out of this user and log back in with the admin user so we can access the dashboard of the site once again network admin let's go to the plugin settings and let's check back these two checkboxes one we uh, copy the content of posts pages and all the that database of the website and the other will also copy files from the main website of the multi-site install to the new website the user creates so let's save these settings and let's get back here and now we can create a new demo and hit create demo here uh, the process of the creation of this demo will take a bit longer because the plugin also copies now some files and copies the database but after a couple of seconds the new website should be presented to the user so you should add also a text besides the form where the user enters the capture that you might have to wait a couple of seconds until the website will be ready for you so the plugin now makes the necessary copying of files and content and in a bit now we should be presented with the new cloned website so uh, bear with me here it is still loading okay so it finished and now we have the working website here and if the customer goes to visit the site he will be presented with a new cloned demo of the original website so you will see that this is a separate website which was created for this specific user and it is a fully cloned website of the original site and he will have he will be able to do whatever he wants with this new demo site he will have plugins themes activated which you set also here in plugin settings okay so this is the new update for the demo my wordpress plugin i hope you will enjoy it and uh, 
keep subscribe to this channel for more videos for more updates for more new plugins and hit also the bell notification to get notified each time i release a new video on this channel i do it each day at 8 pm gmt so yeah thank you guys for staying until the end of the video and until next time stay safe stay awesome bye bye